Welcome to episode 46 of Movement Mondays. We got some sad, sort of happy news for you this week. Of course, it's episode 46. My name is Azriel, and I'm going to drop it down for you real quick and uh, give you updates of what's going on at uh, South Asian Records. First of all, let's talk about our thumbnail. Yes, there were some tech problems going on. Unfortunately, our Seagate hard drive crashed, and we lost a couple of things. I mean, uh, thank God the Lord put it on my heart to back things up. I should have backed it up more than I had to, and more than I should have, or I should have backed it up more than I did. But, you know, it is what it is. So, from January to August, everything's backed up. You know what I mean? But from, like, uh, streets unto mur murderous thoughts, that stuff is kind of in the ether right now. So, uh, I got a tech guy, Craig, from CNC Repair, Computer Repairs. He lives, uh, he got a uh, shop right here in Blackwood. And uh, he's been helping me get that stuff back up. The studio is up and running. You know what I mean? Our computer is fixed. Uh, he was gracious enough to hook me up with um, some affordable prices. And so now we have software that backs up all our data every day at a certain time um, to an external hard drive. We also replaced the hard drive in our computer with an SSD down with Seagate. Don't ever put Seagate in your computer. I'm not the only one who had problems with their hard drives. You know what I'm saying? But with that, um, the tech problems, we're recovering from that, and we're still looking forward to put out uh, a track this month for you need to, uh, to check out and enjoy. It, all right? So moving on, if you notice, I got my tablet down here because you know I like to keep my notes about me. Futuristic Movements. That was one of the tracks that I unfortunately lost. Um, I do have the lyrics because, you know, I put my lyrics on a flash drive. I don't know if you can see it. I put my lyrics in the flash drive in my tablet and um, have it in the booth ready for me to go whenever I get the chance to go in there to lay down the track. So I have the lyrics for it. It's just that I lost the beat for it. So what I've done is taken a track from my uh, Fade to Black album that's coming out in 2022 and I'm replacing the lost track with one of the tracks from there. Uh, it's called The Path Home. I think we just opened this door. It's called The Path Home. And in place of futuristic movements that'll be coming out in its place on November 30th. All right, you gotta go bathroom. Yeah, food's in the back. See, he interrupted Movement Mondays for some food that was in the back. <laughs> anyway, moving on. Uh, yeah, so futuristic movements was pretty much half lost. So that's been put on the back burner until I can get back into the studio and, and remake the track and things like that. But in its place, the path home will be coming uh, out on November 30th in its place. October singles, of course, was uh, Streets and uh, Murderous Thoughts. Episode 44 will give you more detail and insight into that. Um, there's two versions of Murderous Thoughts. As we explained before, there's a, there's a clean version and a version with the profanity in it. We don't glorify violence, we don't glorify profanity, but we felt the language, really Malik? We felt the language better better expressed our, our emotions and the reality of, of a brother killing the brother, you know what I mean? So those tracks are out and streaming now for you. All right, real quick, we're gonna go through our streaming numbers, okay? Fallen Like Geronimo had 210. Following Your Heart had 159. Treason had 163. Survival had 270. Brothers Keeper had 167. We Refuse had 131. SWT had 130. Bot With Me had 110. Seen the Rain had 49. Fly Through the City Rain had 75. It gets rude as 44. Streets has 21. Murderous thoughts has 31. And since January, we've had 1,560 streams. And since the movie began in August, we have the exact number of 4,000 streams up to date. 
let's get to 5,000 before the end of this year. That would be awesome. You know what I'm saying? Um, studio upgrades. Of course, with the crashing of our uh, computer and the trials and tribulations me and my brother's been going through with putting out the music and having to fight fight the darkness and trying to stop our movements. Uh, we haven't had time to go back and like find, put final tweaks in the booth, but that'll get done eventually when we get the time. Um, of course, the Beat Store is up and running um, at solidwreck.com. You can go there and license um, some of the beats that we have uh, created. We're licensing the tracks on our website there. And um, the Futuristic Movements, we're already in November. And, um, Yeah. Hazards of living in an apartment. Noisy neighbors. I guess I'm like uh, Sam, the cooking guy. He has gardeners. I has noisy neighbors too. You know what I mean? So anyway, uh, futuristic movements. Uh, it's about to be peak season at FedEx, so my time is about to get really crunched. You know what I'm saying? Um, but we still, we still have plans to finish putting out the rest of the tracks for this year. So with the next few weeks, children, guys, you gotta love the children, even when you wanna kick them in they would. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But anyway, like I say, yeah, futuristic movements. Uh, FedEx is about to go into peak season, so I'm gonna have a time crunch on that. But in the next couple of weeks, we're gonna have some monster sessions and get everything wrapped up. Our goal is to uh, have everything wrapped up by Thanksgiving, but with the computer crashing and it's just been a mess near the end of this year. As everybody says, 2020 has been a horrible year for everybody. You know what I'm saying? So um, we're gonna have a monster sessions in the next couple of weeks and, and get things wrapped up. But all in all, that's Movement Mondays. Hopefully you prepared yourself for Thanksgiving. I hope you have something to be thankful for. If you're looking at this, there's something to be thankful for for that because you're still alive, you know what I'm saying? Uh, of course, with COVID around, um, family, family, family gatherings will be um, quite different this year. But that doesn't stop your heart from giving thanks for the things you have been allowed to survive and the things you are surviving. Um, give thanks for things that's happened in your life that was a positive. And, and I guess the final word of encouragement is that through all this pandemic, I think, I think uh, my brother-in-law, um, Tay, had a, had a post up about this, about how if through this pandemic, you're still at the same spot you were before the pandemic, you wasted your time. This especially goes out to my uh, music creators and the people I went to school with or, or people I know in the, in the music field. If you had the idea to start your own business and you're still looking to start your own business, you've wasted this year. You're wasting your time. Get on the ball and get it done. That's, that's, that's your homework. By the end of this month, I want, I want y'all to have y'all business plans done. I want y'all to have y'all platforms up and running. I want y'all to have a, a clear target in sight and the steps required necessary to, to reach them targets. That's your homework. All right. So for me, Osriel, and you are the movement. I wanted her to say your name, but I guess she just wants you to know you are the movement.